everybody, it's Paige, and today's video is going to be a haul, and this is not just any haul, this is a Five Below haul, but it's a Five Below haul where I spent almost $100 on random stuff from Five Below. So, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy, and let's get started. So, if you guys don't know what Five Below is, basically it's a store where everything is $5 or less. So I went there um, unexpectedly and I spent a lot of money. So I'm gonna show you what I spent my money on and then I plan on doing like a uh, trying five below products video or something because there's a lot of stuff in here that I'm really interested to see like how well it works because if it works really well then I definitely wanna let you guys know about it because you know, you know. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, the first thing, that I purchased is this um, inflatable ottoman and this is what it's supposed to look like and um, so yeah I um, thought this was cute and I have no purpose for an inflatable ottoman and they also were selling covers that you could buy separately but I didn't buy the cover because I just thought like a clear pink ottoman would be cute so I spent $5 on that. Next, I bought this DIY crystal bath fizzies kit. So this is what it looks like. Again, this was $5. And um, I thought it was really cool. My mom is a Lush queen. She has a Lush Instagram. Go follow her at ever.nkn.green. I will leave it uh, on the screen. Uh, so go check her out on Instagram. But um, So she knows a lot about bath bombs, so I thought I could like you know, make my own and see what she thinks about those. So I bought that. <laughs> I bought a lot of glittery stuff. Um, so we'll see, like, I'm just kind of grabbing into this bag. So this is going to be so all over the place. I bought these brushes for $5. You get four brushes and um, this is what they look like. I thought they were like kind of cute and um, I actually kind of want to feel them now. So, oh, one just fell out. So this is what they look like. Um, this one's a little bit wonky looking. I'm not sure if you can really tell, but it's not symmetrical, like the bristles aren't. Um, I'm not sure if that's on purpose or not, probably not. Uh, but yeah, I mean, they feel really lightweight and they feel pretty like flimsy, but I don't know. I thought I would give them a shot. So there's another $5 that I'll never get back. I bought some of these things. These are like a uh, little like choker tattoo things. So these were a dollar each. These are the tattoo choker necklaces. So I think you put it on like a temporary tattoo or maybe you just peel it off and stick it on. But this one is like a little blood collar, which I thought was really cute. And then this one is like a silver glittery spider web, which I thought was even cuter. So I got those to try. And then I also picked up these a glitter face art. These were a dollar as well. These are just some like silver stars and like a gold moon. And then this was $2. These are gem face art things. And yeah, I thought those were really cute as well. I bought some Wet n Wild makeup and I don't know exactly how much these um, were because they don't have the price on them and I don't know where my receipt is, but um, the, they were less than $5 each. So this is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in this shade Dulce, Dulce de Leche. I'm not sure how you say that, but um, I see a lot of people talk about this. They say it's comparable to the Marc Jacobs like thing that looks very similar to that. And then I also picked up two of the Wet n Wild gel lip liners. I love these so much. I'm actually wearing one of them today. And I picked up the shades Sand Nudes. Sand Nudes. I thought that said Send Nudes, but it says Sand Nudes. And Think Flamingo, Flamingos? Think Flamingos. Cool. Next, I got this Time to Sparkle little kit, and this was $4, and this is um, for your body and face. Oh, face it, or body, that's exciting. So you get a glitter shadow primer, and then you get four glitters in there. I'll take them out so you can see them a little bit better. So yeah, you get this Smoke and Mirrors glitter primer. You get like a super fine purpley glitter. You get a really fine silver glitter, 
a really fine like kind of bronzy reddish kind of glitter and then this is the one that i am most excited for it's like super chunky and there's like all kinds of different stuff in there so this was like the main reason that i wanted to buy that so that was only four dollars for all of that Next, I picked up this Find Your Glow. Oh, this is about the same brand, Smoke and Mirrors. Find Your Glow, create a hyper-dimensional glow for a luminous effect. This is the Disco Holographic Stick, I guess. This was $3. And this obviously reminded me of the Milk Makeup Holographic Stick. Uh, the packaging is very similar and the concept is very similar. Hmm. I wouldn't call it holographic, but it's cute. She's cute. She's got kind of like a pink kind of shift to it. So I think that's really, really fun. Next, I picked up this Tattoo Junkie, and I will say I have tried quite a few of the Tattoo Junkie li liquid lipsticks, and I love them. They come with like a glitter that you can put on top of them, and it like is so magnificent. Highly recommend those. And then I saw that they had an, a highlighter, and I was like, oh, girl. So this is an opalescent highlighter in the shade Naked. Oh shoot, oh it's fine. Okay, almost dropped it. This is what it looks like. Um, like I said, the shade is Naked and oh, it looks so pretty. Oh my gosh. Wow. That is so pretty. Hopefully, you can see it, oh yeah, there she is. That's really exciting. I'm excited to apply that to my face. And now we just have a crap ton of glitter. So I got these, these are the Galaxy Glam Scented Glitter Hairsprays. So I got this pink one, which I'm not sure what it's supposed to be scented like. I don't know. And then we've got a silver one, which again, I don't know what it's supposed to be scented like, but it says that these are cruelty free and paraben free, which is super fun and cute. Um, I wonder, mm, doesn't really smell good, <laughs> but it doesn't smell bad. Um, but yeah, these were again, a couple of dollars each. These weren't $5 each. I don't think, I think they were like maybe three or $4 each, but um, super cute little products there. Then I picked up this unicorn scrub and this is so, 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 so cute. If you guys know me, you know I love exfoliators. This was $4. I wonder if this was on sale. <gasps> Did I get scammed? Okay. So look at this. This says $4, right? And it's covering up a price, so I thought it was on sale, but when I uncovered the price, it says $3. What the heck? Did I just pay $4 for something that was supposed to be $3? Hopefully not. I wonder. I'll have to look for my receipt later. That's annoying. Okay, well, anyway, this is the unicorn scrub, and it's, like, so beautiful. It's got glittery stuff in there, and it's pinky purple, and it's vanilla scented, and, yeah, I'm really excited to try this out. I love, like, squishing it. It's, like, it's not just, like, like, there's some kind of wet thing in here that's, like, binding it all together. So, I picked that up, and then I, oh, this, I forgot about this. This is the Glitter Mask Peel Off Glitter Mask, and this was $2, and um, it's just like a little single-use packet of like a peel-off mask, but I guess it's like really glittery. I hope it looks like this. It probably won't, honestly, but I hope it looks like that. I've been obsessed with like peel-off glitter masks recently, like the um, Glow Job from Too Faced, and then I found a bunch of them at TJ Maxx, like a bunch of like other brands, like super, super cute ones, so I've been really into that. I picked up this Born to Sparkle hair glitter gel. This is melon scented and this is what it looks like. It's just pink and you uh, twist the top off and then you use it and then you... <laughs> melon scented. What even is that? Um, you reseal it for later so that's that. And then the last couple of products that I picked up are all by Smoke and Mirrors. These are the uh, face and body glitters. So this one is just like a fine kind of like silvery glitter. And again, I love that they have this resealable 
cap here so um yeah this was four dollars it's just a bag of glitter and gel that you can put on your face or body and then these ones are super cute these are by smoke and mirrors again um but and these are the face and body glitters but these ones are like crazy so there's like a purple one and like a teal one and these have like little chunks of glitter and big chunks of glitter and these were also four dollars each so yeah that's everything oh and then i got some candy i got those um what are they called Krabby Patty gummies from like Spongebob but they were all different colors they weren't pretty patties but they were like different colors for like Halloween themed it was like a big bag of them we like plowed through that thing like as a family like we ate like almost all of it in the first day <laughs> which is not good but um super super cute those were really fun I I would like to get those again but um yeah so as you can see um stuff adds up fast even if it's only like four dollars four dollars one dollar two dollars um it's really easy to spend almost a hundred dollars at a store where everything is five dollars or less anyways thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed i love you all so so much thank you so much for watching did i already say that i think so um yeah i hope you have a wonderful day and i'll see you in the next one bye